It was all about music, dancing and Caribbean culture. Thousands of people lined René Lévesque to watch the 35th edition of the Cara Fiesta. Sorry, we only started late, but we're going. The parade started a little late, but that didn't matter to those who had come out to celebrate their heritage. It's a tradition, we come every year and we like to represent where we're from, which is Trinidad. Streets along the parade route were shut down for several hours as floats, dancers and bands made their way from Guy Street to Place d'Armes. Police were out in force to keep an eye on the situation, but it went off without a hitch. So far there's nothing particular, everything went very well, uh, except for the weather for sure. That's despite the difficulties in organizing the parade. Two different groups were in charge of putting the parade together this year, causing logistical challenges. So we had kind of two parades, okay. so the kind of the organization is a little bit more complicated. But uh, overall, it went uh, very well. Mother Nature also played a role. The weather was less than stellar. High winds made it difficult for some performers to walk the whole route, and several sudden rain showers had people ducking for cover. But the parade marched on, much to the delight of those who came out to watch. We used to live in Bermuda many years ago, and this is a great venue for everybody from all the islands. Seeing the whole city partake in it, it's really exciting and everything to bring a little bit of Trinidad up here. Some people even managed to smuggle in some extra good cheer to make the festival that much more entertaining. Police say there were less people out to watch this year. Bad weather and competition from the Jazz Fest played a role in the low turnout. But one thing is certain, some of the sights at the Cara Fiesta were spectacular. The women are beautiful. Lisa Fazette, Global News, Montreal.